All right, so I think Jason Park might meet up today. We are at the new hotspot that'll probably get knobs in the next, I don't know, couple days. People have already started getting kicked out. I'm surprised no one's here yet, unless they're further down. Uh, but yeah, the best ground ever for a ledge spot. The only downside is the ledge is wood, but it's pressurized wood, so it, it actually grinds really good. So it looks like a lot of people have already gotten to this ledge. I think this ledge is seriously like a week old. And even though it's the good pressurized wood, it's already getting soft. Uh, Cause you know what wood does when you grind on it, it gets soft. It's not that it gets more sticky. It doesn't, it's not hard enough to have a good friction to keep grinding. But luckily there's a couple of them that aren't waxed at all yet. So this spot still has some life in it. Uh, but yeah, I'm just gonna do a couple warm up things cause this is the first part of the day. And then uh, off to exploring more. Yo, can you film this real quick? Yeah. <laughs> Don't ever say that to me again. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. <laughs> she puts on sunglasses and becomes a worse person. <laughs> They're not even pit vipers. So I would say that this would be the perfect warm-up spot, except for the fact that it's not. Yeah, the ledges are actually kind of tall. They are slightly accessible, but barely. Like, uh, the way to measure that is like where your wheel actually ends up next to it when you lift it up like this. Like, you just barely make it in, so you really have to be all the way back. But the ground is the best. This flat ground is an incredible warm-up spot. The ledges, uh, I hit this spot maybe another day, but it's just gonna be too chunky to keep skating. I know this weekend, I've talked to like a bunch of skaters who are all coming here. That's why we came here early. Uh, so, RIP this spot. Uh, even though it's not dead yet, it will be by the time you see this video. <laughs> that was correct. It's like, you get splinters while waxing it. Okay, <laughs> this sucks. It's a good spot. But it was a lot better a couple days ago. Ah, oh, that was trash. So my neck, my neck is getting progressively worse. Uh, I skated it fine for three days and now it's just acting up again. So I might scrap this day and just go to the doctor and figure out why this keeps happening. Like, I want to skate so bad, but the more I skate, the worse it gets. Throbbing. It's, it's like started off like right here and now it's like spreading down to these traps. Is that what these are? Trap them. Yep, these traps. I know what I'm talking about. Try to do a couple more lines and then be done with this spot. Yeah, it's like uh, the exact height that definitely be uncomfortable for that trick. The spot we came to skate, skate stopped. What the fuck? 
I'm so sad. This is all I wanted to skate today. This is all I wanted to skate today. That's why we came to San Pedro. God dang it. I should have skated. Fuck. Damn, what? <sighs> mm, uh, 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 what? Uh, what do I do? Uh, fuck. Uh. Like, they literally had to bring, like, equipment here to, like, pick one of these up and set it here. This is Jason Park's favorite spot. I don't know why. Okay, maybe that's why. That was a one footer rock fake that I come to the shitty. Do it again, Jason. Do it again for me. Do it again for me, Jason. You get nothing. Oh. That counts. I thought he bailed. Haley, I am the way. Where's, we got blonde fakey first try. Okay, well, yeah, you can warm up. I'll try it. No, you do whatever you want. Oh, I do want a blind fake. Yeah, he wants the blind kick flip this. Well, Something know. about fuck Andrew Allen, I forget. But doing that first try was pretty fucking impressive. So I guess Andrew Allen did blunt kick flip on this thing for some part. And Jason wants to do it for his YouTube. So if you want to see him do it for his YouTube, here's one of the tries. Oh, they're over there skating that nerd spot. We're gonna go over to the real spot across the street. All right, so here's a spot across the street. Kind of a weird cockeyed roll on to roll on grind. Has a fun little kink. We're not waxing it. I just 50-50 did it a couple times. It's really dry. Come on, there's like one car coming. You got it. I'll protect you. Dan, I got you. I got you. Come on, come on, run it back. Run it back. No one's coming. Run. Come on, you got a hundred shit coming, but... Oh my, no, no. And now we wait some more. Gotta love LA. Damn. I don't know why you're doing it again. That was fucking amazing. Ugh. Okay. Okay. in between tries. This, this is the best spot I've ever been to. Nice. Like, I, I love the fact that they skate stop this bank like all the way around. Even in the spots that it's not skatable, like it's like kind of worthless where this rail is because it's in the way. But this bank that goes on forever, which in my opinion is almost the coolest spot. <laughs> Stro back So this place has all these options. This is actually where the uh, old famous LA high rail used to be right here. Uh, Corey Keen put it back so you could like get tricks on it again, but they tore it out right away. Anyways, a bunch of spots here. I'm gonna throw around in here and then UCLA probably.
there's so many uh, helicopter twigs. You ever look at something where everything looks familiar and then you realize nothing is familiar? That's so good. What is it? Dark chocolate. Get it. Chocolate bar, let me say. You want to see? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Like an or wow. I would get it if um, it doesn't have nuts in it. We got a whole ass cheesecake. Marble cheesecake. <laughs> like, look at this wall. Dude, Beverly Hills rules. <laughs> this gas station is the nicest place. Haley said it was the best bathroom she's ever been in. Oh. I was gonna, I said best gas station bathroom, but honestly, maybe best bathroom ever. Oh, so this is so good. <laughs> <laughs> best gas station cheesecake I've ever had in my life. They have all these rare chocolates. The ch I didn't get to look at the chips. So they, she, Haley said they all kinds of fancy chips, with truffle flavors, and yeah, like what? Stop to this manual pad real quick, just because it's really good. <laughs> Why do you do that? What's funny is I missed, <laughs> but I did it. So technically, I didn't touch. Ninja. That was scary. Yeah, the runoff's definitely 95% of the difficulty of this spot. That's what I just said. He's copying me. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god. Damn. That's hard to shove it up. I don't notice how big my board is until I do shove it. Then I'm like, oh, this thing's long. Yeah, but it's probably fun to do shove it's with. It's really fun to do shove it's with. Everything on it's really fun. But mostly just shove it's and three shoves. I don't know about three shoves. Let's see one. You just like, want me to fall? What now? I love that trick. I love well, that, that trick goes. on bigger boards. Oh, this is the three shot board. That's what I'm saying. I will say it's been a second. I mean, obviously, because I hurt my neck too, but that I've just gone out and only skated street and it's been, it's been a good feeling. I haven't uh, been as streety as I would like to be. But now that I'm like working on, like I'm back to working on this video part. Uh, excited to be back out here today. I have I've just mostly been checking out spots that I want to do tricks at. Like there's a lot of stuff that I want to do at this college alone. But every single spot that we've been to today, it, I have something that I want to film for an actual part for. Um, but yeah, more spots to check out. Uh, maybe I'll end up doing something I'm really stoked on. We'll see. Next spot, Angle Iron Ledge into a Little Incline. Looks like the most fun, playful spot ever. Haley's gonna get hit by a car. Yeah, cross arms. Is that Chaz or T's? <laughs> Haley's over here bragging that she didn't wax the angle iron ledge. <laughs> Are you gonna bump the ledge? <laughs> bump to crook. I can't have anything. My neck starts hurting, so all of a sudden her knee has to hurt. It's fucking ridiculous. Okay, you got it. Just know that we're this close to having the coolest ride on grind ever. A little kink and then ride into the bank. Like if you didn't want kids to learn backside feebles on ledges, why did you give these benches so much transition? How uncomfortable is that? I'm gonna sleep here tonight. 
said it's the worst bench ever. Yeah, these are terribly designed benches. 